Right, this is grade two, module one, lesson four. And in this lesson, we are learning how to make a 10 to add within 20. Um, this is a strategy amongst many strategies that we're going to be teaching the students. It's not the only way that we want students to add, but it's one way, and it's a nice little way that leads to really some nice mental math. So let's get practicing. So the idea for make a 10 is we know we have an 8 in this case, and let's decompose the 4 so that we have a 10. So in this case, 8 plus 2 gives us our 10, so that becomes 10 plus 2, which is 12. So our 12 goes right here. Now the big thing is, um, did we have to decompose the 4? Could we have decomposed the 8? And the answer is yes. So parents and teachers, if a student wants to leave the 4 alone and decompose the 8 in order to make a 10, let that kid do it. There's absolutely nothing wrong with that. So let's practice over here. So in this case, I'm going to leave the 9 alone. I guess maybe because it's the one that's closest to 10. And then I'm going to decompose the 7 so that I can get a 10. So I'm thinking about 9. Hmm. 9 is 1 away from 10. So I'm going to decompose 7 to be 1 and 6. So 9 plus 1 is 10. 10 plus 6 is 16. So our answer is 16. Let's keep practicing. So here's my 9 right here is my 9. I want to bump that up to a 10. So that means I'm going to decompose the 3 to a 1 and a 2 because 1 plus 2 is 3. So now 9 plus 1 gives us 10 plus 2 left over which is equal to 12. And lastly 8 is pretty close to 10. We need 2 more so I'm going to decompose that 6 to be 2 plus 4. So now we have 8 plus 2 is 10. 10 plus 4 is 14. And the last slide for this video, it's a word problem. So we've got Ronnie, he uses 5 brown bricks and he uses eight red bricks to build a fort. Woohoo! Ronnie's having fun. So how many bricks does Ronnie use in all? So the idea is we've got five plus eight. Two different ways that we could um, decompose and make a ten. One way is we can say, hmm, let we have a five and we want to bump it up to a 10, so we need 5 more. So we could say this is a 5 and a 3. So 5 plus 5 is 10, plus 3 gives us 13. That's not the only way. We could have said, well, 8 is pretty close to 10. We need 2 more to get it up to 10. So let's decompose the 5 to 3 plus 2. 2 plus 8 is 10. 10 plus 3 is 13. So parents, teachers, we have two different ways to solve this problem. One is not better than the other. Um, let your students choose which method they want at this point. But the whole point of this whole lesson is to help kids bump things up to the next 10. We do want them to be practicing that strategy at this point. And that wraps up Grade 2, Module 1, Lesson 4, Making a 10 to Add Within 20.